Question 34. A fixed resistor and a diode are connected in series to a battery of EMF 6 volt. Okay, so the battery has an EMF 6 volt and negligible internal resistance. The graph shows the variation with potential difference V of the current I of the diode. So this is a VI graph for diode, uh, not for the whole circuit, just for diode. So the V, this V, is actually a voltmeter that we connect here lah, to measure the diode. Okay, current in the diode is 40 milli ampere. Okay, Ken, what is the resistance of the fixed resistor? Okay, so let's look at this 40 milli ampere first. 40 is here. Can dot 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 dot. And this neither here nor there one is a bit annoying. But I'll dot this one down. I have a way to get over it. Lah. But I'm thinking about the, let's say this is the resistance R. And this is RD for diode. Okay. So I can use the equation V is equal to IR for this circuit. For this entire circuit. But how do I do that? Well, um, I can put 6 is equal to. 40 milli times r. I think this rt is total. Uh, so I'm going to put this one as rt. So I can find the total resistance of the circuit of the two things in parallel, sorry, in series. And this one would be 150 ohm. Okay. So if rt is 150 ohm, meaning if I can find this whole thing is 150 ma. If I can find the resistance of the diode, I can subtract to find the resistance of the resistor. Can? If I can find this, I can find this. So how do we find the resistance of diode? Resistance of diode is actually the ratio of V over I. Okay? So you may be thinking, Miss, I don't know what this V is. Leh. Is it 1.2? Is it 1.3? Okay, I tell you what. Thankfully, this is a straight line. Okay, so if you want to, you can choose another point <laughs> and do the ratio. But I'm just going to stick to this lah and just try my best to estimate. And because the answers look like very far away. So as long as I get something close enough, I am satisfied with the objective. Okay, so this one is 1.25. Okay, and here is half of 1.25 so i think here to here i can take three quarter la, okay so i will take this reading here as 1.0 plus three quarter of a small box okay so i'm assuming that here to here is three quarter okay one small box was 0.25 0 0.5? Yeah, 0 0.25. Okay, so I'm going to press my calculator now. 0 0.75 times 0 0.25. I'm just, I'm just estimating, okay? So this will be 1.1875 volt. Just estimating. So this is why for paper 3, do not recommend you plot in between boxes like this. So this is the value here. Okay, 1.1875. So I'll put it in. Uh, v is 1.1875. I is 40 milli. Okay, and if I press my calculator, 1.185 divided by 40 milli. I'll get something like 29.68.69. Okay, la, I'm just going to put this as 30 ohm because I got answer already. So if here to here is 30, because it's in series, right? So if this is 30 ohm, then this will be 120 ohm. Because 30 plus 120 is 150. The answer is B.
okay so first things first when you encounter a circuit like this uh ready your brain ask yourself is it series is it parallel is it some weird bridge circuit which obviously is not this is two things in series so if they are in series one equal to ir so v equal to ir is the one equation to rule them all but you need to modify a bit so first i apply v equal to ir for the whole circuit you have two resistors in a uh, series my objective is to find the total resistance because i know from the vi graph i can find the resistance of the diode okay so i found that the total resistance of the resistor and the diode is 150. now i need to find the resistance of the diode problem with this graph is that at 40 milliampere the graph is kind of sasa you know like what is this it's not half it's more than half so i estimated i guesstimated it at 3 over 4. if you have ruler during exam even nicer you put your ruler here la, and measure la, okay but i'm guessing that this is 3 over 4 of a box of one box so i take 3 over 4 times uh the value of one box which is 0 0.25 and i don't forget to add the one in front also la. so i get 1.1875 at this reading so i can put that in divide by the current which is 40 milliamps to find the resistance of the diode once i have the resistance of the diode i can subtract with 150 to get 120. so ready your brain you definitely will use v equal to ir in paper one Okay, that's it for the question.